for the product, you are the product. If uh, the blockchain marries social, uh, you know, we're talking about distributed storage. We're talking about uh, APIs. You got to bring in APIs as the API evangelist, and uh, we're talking about people having a lot more control over their information. But, uh, from my point of view, you know, the technology itself is less interesting than the functionality that it provides, what it enables you to do as a user. So, as you, yes. and not only that, but you know, I would feel really good about taking my life out of the hands of Facebook and putting it into my own hands. I, I don't want them to have my data. I don't want them to know anything about what I'm talking about or anything else. I want my conversations to be mine. I want to control them. I want to know where they are. I'm not interested in anybody else doing that for me as a service. If the technology enables me to do that on my own, spectacular. And so you can control the commissions, you control who actually ac accesses those conversations. I guess you could even have a little bot that says to companies who want to access your conversations, hey, please pay me some micro coins. Yes, yeah, so it's actually a way for me to, I mean, it also provides me an opportunity to monetize my own conversation, my own data. That's really interesting. And how would APIs play a role in that? Kid? You could open up third-party access, you can revoke third-party access. So you would have all of your conversations in, within your network, within your wallet. You could take those with you and move them to whatever network you wanted. And, and what I really like about it is that no one can shut you down if you're a developer from accessing conversations that are in the blockchain. You can't change the rules once it's out there. Well, another aspect of that also is that it, it, it prevents somebody like Facebook from arbitrarily censoring my conversations. So if you think about the coins themselves as a picture, I can, I can personalize their look. I can make them stand out. I can add additional functionality that would make them stand out in different ways. So if I have an API that allows me to access the technology, I can add all kinds of functions. I can make a game out of my conversation as I put game aspects to it. I can do basically anything I want. Well, this really, uh, for me, uh, puts puts focus on the real value of data and storage rather than the speculative value that's created by markets and kind of you know people uh, you know wanting there to be value and hyping it up. Is, well, and also the fact that it's packaged up and it's in units which can be easily shifted around, that also gives you an object that you can value. Yeah, so it, it provides you something to look at to place a value on, as opposed to an amorphous conversation that takes place in an arbitrary social media platform. They're all of the, um, the industries that I've been a part of and the trends that I've watched. I've never seen an industry that has been so far ahead of itself um, than, than blockchain and crypto. <laughs> Thank you very much, everyone.